Hey guys, how you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to the channel. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to shout out to those of you guys who have been subscribing to my channel. I appreciate you. It means so much. This video is um, it's kind of educational tutorial or how to use Microsoft Okay, I received this question. Someone asked how to add numbers or bullet points to your work. So if you are a student, they give you work to do at uni and you want to show your creativity, you want to show things you can do, you want to show your IT skills. And once you finish this assignment, you can add cover letter or cover page on it then add numbers things you need to do so i want to show you we need to do this by going to microsoft words so okay so this microsoft word click it open and now this is microsoft word so we need to bring out okay bring assignment of okay to show you so i'm going to go to to documents and select this particular document this document now is and uh, a document that I did, okay, regarding how media helps us, okay. So this is just to give you an example. Media is important, okay, to 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 us. Now this this information is really article I wrote to my for my site, okay, regarding media, how media is helping us. What I want to show you is actually how you can insert okay um numbers to your work okay to insert numbers to your work now this to insert page number so you just need to go to insert go to the home page okay go to homes and select insert once you select insert then you need to go to you can see where the cursor is you can see header footer so this how to insert header and footer and the home page is what I'm going to show you. So insert a header, you select header, okay? Then you select the type of header you want, blank one or blank with three colors or Austin or branded, okay? So your header can be any types, okay? So you can choose. So if you want blank header, you select, select on it and this is the header, okay? So in this header now you can write your name vincent okay so you can type your name on top then underneath it student id so you put your student number on it okay and once you finish it close it and this header now will show okay on all the pages of your document on can see vincent and student number okay it will show on all the pages of your document if you scroll down you can see all of them here and see vincent okay going to circle it so that you can see just gonna draw it a, a little bit okay you can see here you can see this is vincent okay you can see what okay so what just gonna move this away so that this exit don't save okay so what I want to show you we we'll go back again to bring this document okay open it up open this document okay here here is the full document okay you can see with underline on it so if you want to remove this underline select click control v control u will remove the underline if you want to add underline control u again u. okay so but you need to first of all select particular area okay if you are writing anything or a specific area you want you need to co copy it okay copy it first of all and uh, once you copy it select control u is underline and that this area now is underlined if you want to remove it that particular area copied select control u again to remove it and you can see it's removed so this is how to put underline 
the other thing i want to show you is how to okay so this is the title we want to add um, insert header okay so go to insert and this is header scroll on it select blank header and write your name here okay and your student id once you finish vincent okay student number student number okay let's say two three four five so type the student number once you finish it okay close it okay and this header okay will be showing on all the page you can see the net can see it here okay if you want to draw okay here is this is the header here okay don't mind my drawing okay so you can if you want exit it so i'm going to show you exit drawing okay so this uh, this is how to do it okay you can see vincent here if you scroll down again you can see vincent and the student number so it will be on all the pages so this is the things i want to show you the second thing i want to show you is select insert okay and go to go to home page okay so go to insert once you go to home page select in home page insert okay now go to footer okay so we put header select footer okay and here is the footer so this now type your name vincent okay this is how to insert footer and header vincent student number student number two three four five six seven eight okay example okay you can see so close it so now we have student number on the header and bottom you can see this is the header student number is here and also the bottom student number okay so it will be on all the pages so you need to choose if you want your student id to be on top or the or on the header or you want it to be on the footer so this is how to insert header and footer on your work in your work okay now the other thing i want to show you is also how to name pay, how to insert page numbers okay so we'll go to insert again okay select so we done header we done footer now we want to do do page number add page number you can see where do you want the page number to be top of the page bottom of the page or margin so if you select top of the page okay then you select plan the page number will be on top you can see this document then you close it once you close it then you can you will see this is the page one you can see the number here okay i'm going to draw so that you can see this is the page one and this is where we have the number okay if you scroll down again if you scroll down Sure, what I can be able to see if, if you exit it, exit drawing, then you scroll down the, the second. This is page two, okay. Number two, okay, and number three, number four. So these are the skills your tutor, okay, expect you to have to show your you know IT skills, showing them that things you can do. So by inserting page number, okay, if you also so now also in certain header putting your name student work so we have this okay the the page number we put on top but if you want this page number to be on the bottom so we select insert again okay and go to the home page select insert and go to full page number instead of top you can remove it okay if you want to remove the the number we put on the top you select to remove it so the number right now is removed so if you if you look over here you can see the number again so we want to insert the page number at the bottom select the bottom page okay once select bottom page then you select plan number we have plan number two so the plan number the number is by the side okay and also plan number two the number is by the, to the middle plan number three the number is by the side okay right side okay you can also use x page x so we'll see i'm going to show you page number one select on it 
Okay, if you scroll down now, so that the, then make sure you close close it so that you can check. You can see the bottom page. This is the page one. You can see it on the bottom here. I'm going to draw so they can see it where the keeper now. So this is the page one, the bottom. Okay, is it drawing? Now, so we have identify page one. This is page two. This is page three. And this is page four. Okay, and this is page five. Okay, this is page six. So this is how to insert, okay, page number, header, and footer. If you're happy with this tutorial, please, then you can let me know. Do consider to subscribe. If we help you, okay, with your work, I will appreciate if you subscribe, share. Okay, so this, uh, I hope, okay, that this will help students out there to insert page number, header on their work. Okay, so let, let me know if there's anything else you want to know. Uh, let, let us know and we'll be happy to show you. Okay, check my video also how to insert page, okay, cover. Okay, check my video and also how to remove and add underline. Okay, if you find this helpful, Please do consider to subscribe and help the channel. Thank you very much indeed and stay blessed. Thank you.